Today we're talking all about the Joy <laughs> XL from Carry Kit. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Nicole. On this channel, we talk about everything from product reviews, bag reviews, and more. So if you're new here, definitely consider subscribing. Today we're gonna talk all about the brand new Carry Kit Joy XL in their gorgeous Texas leather. I'm gonna show you how I have it all packed up, what it looks like when I'm wearing it, and every little tiny feature. So if you've been in the market for this bag, I'm gonna give you the skinny on it today. I will also link the bag in the description box of this video. So if there's anything you see in this video you wanna snag, definitely check the description box right down below. All right, let's go ahead and jump right in. All right, let me tell you a little bit about the leather that's used on this bag. Um, this is the Signature Texas Leather, which is a semi-veg tan leather, which means it is tanned with vegetable oils. It contains no artificial colors. The texture on the leather is absolutely stunning and beautiful. You can condition it um, a couple times of the year with leather conditioner, and it's just a really, really beautiful finish. I absolutely love it. It's paired with gunmetal hardware, so that's what you see here on the zipper and on the zipper poles. I think it looks really nice and sleek on this black bag. This bag does come in another another color, which is tan. So if black is not your jam, you can also grab it in this really beautiful tan color. All right, now that we've talked a little bit about the leather and the hardware, let me prop the camera up and show you how I have it all packed up and tell you all about the pockets and all of the features of the interior of the bag. Let's do it. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at how I have the Carry Kit Joy XL all packed up. Like I mentioned, this is in the black Texas leather with gunmetal hardware. And on the very, let's start with the pocketing on the front of the bag. Just love the pleat on the front of this one. Also on the front is this little zippered pocket. And in here, I just have my hand sanitizer and a couple of hair ties. When I'm using a smaller card case wallet, this is also a great place to put that as well. It's quick and easy to get to, and the zippers are really, really nice and smooth. All right, this is the, I'm gonna refer to this as like the mommy pocket on the front. Right here, it has double zipper pulls and they do have a little locking mechanism if you'd like to attach a little lock if you're traveling, um, which I think is a really cool feature. And let me go ahead and zoom in just a bit. All right, here's a look at the mommy pocket. So. Right in here, you're gonna have this leather slip pocket. I understand that on previous versions of this bag, this used to be card slots, um, but in here, I just have my favorite charger. I love this because it has three different cables. It has a USB-C, it has a mini USB, and it has a lightning cable. And so you're able to charge three devices at the same time, or three different kinds of devices. And then you just plug it into the wall to charge it up for next time. Next to the charger, I have my Luminu teeth whitening pin. And then on the front of the leather pocket, there is a little teeny tiny D-ring right there. And I don't have anything on that, but that would be a good place to put like my lippy clip, perhaps. Next to it, there's an elastic pin loop. I have a pin inside of it and then a pin right next door to it. And then in the elastic pocket right here, I just have two of these little tart um, lip lippies. I have my favorite lip balm and then I have a foldable hairbrush. And that is a look at what that pocket looks like, totally empty. There is more space right here on the top if you needed to toss something else in there. I really, really like the amount of room on the inside right here. Another awesome pocket is this one right at the top of the bag. And in here, I just keep some of my bribery lollipops and my favorite lip product. <laughs> so I have two of these little mini Tootsie Pops and then another lipstick <laughs> right in the top because it's easy to get to and my kids don't really look in this pocket so the bribery lollipop is safe there you have a really nice rolled handle right here which is nice and sturdy and really made of great quality um, and those are the pockets on the front of the bag also on the front you'll see the carry kit logo right here really really nice and sweet and then as you turn the bag to the side You'll see there is a D-ring right here, so you can attach stroller straps if you'd like. I just have my little um, leather Mina Bay coin purse, and in here I have my Clippa bag hook, and then I have a reusable straw. So it just looks like that. Super cute. You can also put your AirPods in there if you wanted to. There is an elastic pocket. I have my cell phone in there, 
um, but it is a really, really nice, generous pocket. It's stretchy, it's leather, it's so well done. I really like how they constructed the pocket. I think it's awesome. You'll see in this pocket over here, I have the 19 ounce insulated water bottle from Awala, and that fits no problem at all. I also have a little inch bug label right across the bottom for my daughter. Uh, but I think the 32 ounce Awala would fit totally fine in here. The pocket really has some great, great stretch. Moving around the back of the bag, there are even more features back here. So you have these really nice padded leather backpack straps. They are super comfortable. And the adjuster on the bottom looks just like this. You have those little rings and then here is the tail. And then right here, there's a little secret pocket. And in this little secret pocket, I just have a package of wet ones, but this pocket actually goes all the way across the back of the bag. So I think it's really nice and convenient. If you want to put maybe a diaper and a wipe back here for emergencies, you, I think that would be a great use of that pocket as well. In the back, you also have a magnetic pocket. This is a extra pocket or you can use it as a trolley sleeve. Let me go ahead and tip the bag down and we'll take a quick look. You can unzip the bottom right here, slip it over your suitcase, and it will be the perfect travel companion. You can also see down here at the bottom it has some feet. All right, now let's take a look at how I have the inside all packed up. As we open the inside compartment, you'll see that the zipper pull does also have another locking mechanism right there in case you wanted to um, lock it up tight while you're traveling. This is what the interior looks like and how I have it packed up. And um, let me take my keys right off the top here. This is just an O-Venture key ring, my little rough and tumble coin pouch, and then my keys. And you may see the first thing is my lippy clip kind of dangling from the ceiling here. Um, and that's because there is a little key fob. If you can see that right there, you can attach your keys. So that way they are quick and easy to find in your bag at all times. I really like that. I've never seen a key fob placed there before, um, but I just had my little lippy clip with my chapstick hanging from that. A look into the bag like this, you can see quickly and easily kind of everything I have. And then look at all of the extra space I have. So much room. If you're carrying a baby wrap, if you're carrying a, a muslin blanket, I mean, jackets in the winter time, <laughs> that could definitely fit right here. All right, these first two pockets are elastic. In this one, I have a keep going first aid kit. You guys have seen this one uh, many times. I love the way this one is organized. It's super cute and perfect. In the pocket next to it, I have my Elta MD hand cream. And I did want to mention the bag also comes with an extra pouch, which I'll insert a photo of right here too. Um, she refers to it, I believe, as a wet bag. I don't know if I necessarily use it that way, but it is nice to have an extra pouch and great that it comes included with the price of the bag. Um, over here I have a Bumco Baby Wipes pouch and it has a full package of wipes in that. I also have my little Kuyana leather pouch which has just some necessities for me. I have a Lysol hand, or no, a Lysol spray. I have boogie wipes, contact solution. Um, you know, just kind of the random odds and ends I might need. Then I have my MZ Wallace Crosby wallet. Um, and I love using this with the larger bag because it has a chain strap and a wristlet. So I can just kind of grab this and run into the store if I'd like. I do have a full review on that bag that I'll link up in the cards. And then I have my little MZ Wallace hot pink pouch. And in here I have everything from the bug bite thing, some little mini Advil sticker books. I have little cars for the kiddos. Um, deodorant, little travel scissors, you name it, all kinds of stuff in here. Um, as I tip this forward, you'll see there are elastic pockets on either side of the bag. One right here, one over here, and then a snap pocket right here in the back. In this pocket, I just have my packed party snack bag with some snacks for my kiddos. And that is lightly padded as well, I wanted to mention, and it has a traditional snap, if you can see that. Then in the way back of the bag, there is a leather trim zippered pocket. And back here, I just have a bunch of little things, a mosquito wipe, a, a um, chapstick, this little boo-boo stick from the small business that I love. It's, a, it's by Nourish. And toilet seat covers, a Hello Kitty mirror. And then I also have chap floss and my little travel floss. 
This bag can hold a 13 to 14 inch laptop and so I wanted to pop mine in here and see how it would do. That is what it looks like with a laptop inside. There is still so much room in the bag for notebooks, for your tech accessories, your chargers, whatever you might want. I just tossed another little notebook in there, but it is perfect. I think it would be great for school, for travel, for babies, you name it. I think it's a amazing, amazing bag. Guys, so that is it for the video today. I hope that you enjoyed it. If you did, be sure to give the video a big thumbs up and subscribe, and I'll see all of you guys again in my next video. Bye, guys.